Eye quality and informative content are rare. If you're new to my channel I'm the itemization consultant and expert, and I work with top globals and high elo players and some of them you might even know, what I do is I help them optimize their itemization strategy to give them the competitive edge. Now, without further ado, let's get down to the itemization. Arcane Boots, despite the underwhelming stats, is a necessary evil if we are to optimize for damage. Enchanted Talisman, you need CDR for your second skill, because if it's on cooldown it would be very difficult to trigger her passive. You can also be more active with teleportation and outflanking enemy heroes. Genius Wand, despite all the nerfs, it's still one of the best damage boosters. Additionally, the added movement speed and debuff it provides can greatly benefit not only the wielder, but also their teammates, enhancing their overall effectiveness in battles. Glowing Wand proves to be a valuable choice, thanks to its burn effect that aids in stacking the debuff of Genius Wand. Although it may have lower magic power compared to Holy Crystal, its HP base damage makes up for it, resulting in higher overall damage output. Additionally, Glowing Wand provides extra movement speed and HP, enhancing both survivability and mobility. Moreover, the item synergizes well with Hero Luo Yi's second skill, making it a solid option for her. The issue with Clock of Destiny and Lightning Truncheon is that they occupy two item slots, and their damage output is not particularly impressive. The only item they surpass in terms of damage is Enchanted Talisman, which is not primarily a damage item, but rather a utility item that offers significant benefits. Consider Blood Wings for its valuable bonus movement speed, but it is recommended to purchase it only if you have the necessary resources. Divine Glaive is a suitable choice to counter opponents with high magic resistance. Holy Crystal is still part of our build, but we only purchase it as the fifth or last item when we have accumulated more magic power to fully maximize its passive effect. Legendary! An enemy has been slain! Winter Truncheon synergizes well with your ultimate ability, allowing you to freeze yourself to avoid damage and then teleport out of danger. It is most effective as a fifth item, coinciding with the stage of the game where deaths are more common. That's all for today's itemization lesson. If you found it helpful please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications so you won't miss any future content. Thank you for watching, love you guys and may you have more win streaks. See you guys, until next time bye now.